The point is that in terms of astrophysical conditions, Kepler 452b checks more boxes than almost any other planet we've discovered so far. But the most important new discovery isn't about the planet itself. It's about how we are learning to detect life. Future telescopes, like the next generation of space observatories and large ground-based arrays, are being built specifically to analyze the atmospheres of distant exoplanets. Not just for temperature or composition, but for biosignatures. Chemical signs that on Earth are strongly associated with life. Things like oxygen, methane, ozone, gas combinations that shouldn't coexist unless something is constantly producing them. If in the future we observe Kepler, 452 BS atmosphere and find a mix of gases that's wildly out of equilibrium, that would be one of the strongest hints of biological activity we've ever seen. Not proof, but a serious clue, because chemistry lies when physics forces it to, but biology lies all the time, and it leaves fingerprints.